Hi, Vera with the Stock Market Live uh, Today we are going to address uh, one of the companies uh, or stocks trading uh, on New York Stock Exchange, which I consider a bubble stock uh, I sold and I uh, reverse it to the short side and I do have a strong sell rating on shares uh, while everyone else, uh, I'm referring to Wall Street in general, they have been uh, raising targets in this uh, company. And in my opinion, uh, uh, it is a mistake, uh, even shares uh, continue moving higher, I do consider that they are overvalued and uh, I think that you are likely to see uh, an important correction before uh, shares they uh, become a uh, buying opportunity again. Having said this, I'm going to refer here to uh, a livestock chart. I'm going to refer to what I'm looking for in this company going forward, uh, including uh, earnings, my trades uh, and recommendations in this company. And then it is up to you to make your own decision and bear in mind that this stock pick it is also available in uh, other service. I'm referring, for example, to my uh, recent uh, uh, course, uh, which contains several stock picks, uh, live analysis for traders, technical analysis for traders, where I've been discussing this uh, stock. All right. So uh, I'm going to refer here to the live stock chart to start with, to uh, disclose which company we are referring to. And the company, it is this one. Uh, this is the livestock chart. And the company is uh, precisely in one of the sectors that they have been very bullish about. I'm referring to uh, the steel uh, sector, okay? So uh, the company is called the AKS Steel. I upgraded the shares to a strong buy at $1.87 and uh, I recommended to sell, to bail out of uh, this company at uh, uh, the price that you see here live uh, on the chart, $11.01. And, uh, uh, that is to say that above that price, I consider uh, the stock to be a strong sell and a wonderful selling short opportunity. So what I'm going to do here is uh, to position myself in order for you to visualize uh, the chart. I'm going to make here the zoom function, all right? And you have it here, 100% sold, 101 live, and you have here precisely the day when I sold shares of AKS deal, okay? So I consider this a uh, wonderful selling short opportunity. Uh, that is my uh, opinion with regards to uh, this matter. And uh, I consider that the price target here uh, can go down or all the way down to $7.70 to $7.30, okay? So I'm rather bearish uh, this uh, stock. In other words, I consider this a bubble stock uh, where the momentum is very high, but uh, no reason whatsoever to buy shares. In fact, uh, reasons, yes, to sell short the stock on uh, spikes, on strength, and to maintain a short position, looking eventually for that price target range, uh, $7.70 to $7.30, okay? And bear in mind that this stock, since it is a speculative instrument, and here I'm not going to teach about speculative instruments, the long-term trend or uh, range, in fact, in this company, that is to say where the real support is, it is all the way down to more or less $5, okay? So to be buying shares of AKS Steel at $11 plus, it is unreasonable. It is a, a bubble. That is my uh, personal opinion. You might uh, have a different one, but that is my personal opinion, all right? So uh, I would consider to go back to the long side if there is a crash or an important correction in shares of AKS Steel. Uh, if there is not, I will not consider to buy the stock just because the company then uh, uh, reports good earnings and so, so on. Okay? So this also to say that today the company reported earnings, the earnings they were good. Okay? And uh, for example, I think that uh, probably you are likely to see Wall Street upgrades. And what I did, <coughs> it was to add to the short side, precisely today, once the company reported earnings, at $10.20, okay? Because I don't visualize 
uh, the upside to be reasonable to consider maintaining uh, investment position in um, uh, AKS deal. Okay, so I added to the short side, I repeat, as of today, once the company <coughs> reported earnings, it reported earnings today, I added to the short side and I consider feasible or uh, eventually share price to plunge down to the region $7.70 to $7.30. But you have to be aware that the share price, I mean, there are many events going forward, many things, many circumstances, many factors and so on. If something happens rather negative toward this company, for example, uh, Donald Trump policy is not to be, uh, you know, in place for a long period of time or so on, it can, <coughs> it can have <coughs> that the share price in uh, AKS still, the ticker AKS that you have here, okay, AKS, just for your reference, that the share price can move or to crash uh, all the way down to the major trend line, okay? And only at the major trend line I would consider to invest or to buy back shares of this company and not, uh, you know, at $11 or $10 just for momentum issues, okay? So strong sell rating in AKS still. Uh, I do have currently a short position on the stock after selling live here, as you can see, $11.01. <coughs> and <coughs> as of today, I added to the short side at $10.20 and this is my current position and my view with regards to AKS for the rest of 2017, okay? And will not be changed regardless of the price. For example, if the price goes to 13 or whatever, uh, that is my personal opinion with regards to this company, okay? That is a speculative instrument. You should not ever buy or chase momentum in speculative stocks other than <coughs> to do <coughs> here what I'm telling you that is to bail out of a position and to lock the profit. You also not obliged or forced to sell short AKS still if you don't want to, okay? And uh, what else to say? Much, nothing else in particular. Bear in mind that this is a momentum leg, a tremendous momentum leg. You have articles on the blog of the company with regards to this. I'm going to finalize by saying that my uh, trade alert in AKS still is coincident with my trade alert in US Steel to sell shares at $38, okay? That is to say that I consider AKS Steel even worse than US Steel, okay? More speculative. So uh, uh, if I sold US Steel at 38 a complementary live streaming session that you had on the website of the company and the video is available worldwide on YouTube, on Vimeo and so on, well, obviously I was not going to maintain a long position in AKS Steel, okay? So, I have a short position in the AKS still. I consider by far risky investment compared or trading compared to uh, US still. And don't forget also that I sold, uh, sold short US still at $38, okay? Uh, that is also other thing that you should be aware of. And there has been some correction in US still. Having said this, uh, this uh, uh, video is with regards with uh, bubble stocks and my outlook with regards to AKS Steel and not US Steel, okay? So I gave you here all the information that I'm looking for, uh, whether that will be uh, feasible uh, or not. <coughs> we'll see during the rest of 2017, but don't forget uh, to uh, attend or to see or to confirm uh, then the volumes, okay, since the volume is the most important technical indicator, if you see then shares plunging or selling off in very high volume, you have a confirmation that the, your preference should be to sell short the stock instead of buying or predicting then where the top is going to be uh, or the bottom is going to be because then you can, you can lose money in the markets by, or you are very capable of, of you, your skills are very good in that sense. That is to say to try to predict or buy shares on weakness. But if you see, if you prefer the long side in AKS still, <coughs> and if you see that the momentum fades to the point of uh, the bounces are continuously limited, I would say that is preferable to bail out. 
or to sell short the stock, even if you dislike to sell short, like I said, you are not obliged to, okay? So this is my pick on the short side, IKEA still, in the steel sector that I've been very bullish about, as you are uh, aware of, okay? So, uh, thank you very much. And I leave you here with the chart and I uh, say, well, bye bye to you. Wishing uh, good luck going forward in uh, AKS Steel. Thank you.